So as you guys know, I own the Focusrite 4i4 third generation audio interface. It's a fantastic interface. I use it on a daily. It's featured on my channel, as you guys can see there. And it's a fantastic budget, good interface. I enjoy it. I really love it. I've recommended it. So a lot of people ask me what interface to get. I definitely recommend getting a Scarlett interface. And Focusrite just dropped the bomb and released the fourth generation interfaces. And they're really mind blowing with their new features. So let's talk a bit about that and what they have new. So of course, one of their most impressive and most eye-catching features is their all new digital system where the knobs the controls are digitally controlled so when you move the knob you can control it via the focus drive control app or in your computer so you don't have to manually increase the game of the preamp it does it with a digital control so it's really helpful because it has another really awesome feature called safe gain where when you enable it the focus drive automatically after a few minutes of playing adjusts and controls the gain so that you can get the loudest and cleanest cleanest level without clipping which speaking about clipping now you have even louder preamps so you can play even louder and it's gonna be cleaner to work with easier to work with and you can play louder without having to worry about distortion or clipping artifacts because now you can go even further when recording your music production and so these two features alone are really game changer because having a digital interface that you can control in your computer because sometimes you have your interface a bit far from you. It's a bit harder to control games while you're recording or stuff like that. It makes it a lot easier to just have that one click go, especially with the save button now added into the interface. But another really awesome feature is their air emulation. So on the Focusrite third gen, they had a air emulation where it emulated the preamps of their older hardware, creating a really rich and harmonic tone to your recording and added some really nice subtle harmonics to it and made it sound like that unique vintage tone. So now you have the presence in harmonic mode. And so the presence mode, what it does, it adds a little bit more clarity and it's really perfect for vocal recording. So when you're recording vocals, singing and everything related to voice where you need a really bright tone. The presence air mode really enables that sharp clarity that you're looking for when recording vocals. To contrast this, the harmonic drive mode adds more warmth to guitar recording and such by adding a little bit of more warmer, low-end harmonics into the mix. And this is done by the flagship emulation software that's built into the interface. So you don't have to download anything extra. It's already integrated inside of the interface and works really well. I've always used and have enabled my air function on my Focusrite third gen so I can't wait to really test out and really check out the fourth gen air function. Of course with every update there's new design and it still keeps the essential red and black theme but now it looks a lot more classy with the meters so now that you have those digital meters around the knob that looks really fantastic I really love the new modern look that the Focusrite is getting and something that I really like that I notice is having the XLR inputs on the back so that allows for cleaner cable routing and cable management which is something that I've known a lot of Focusrite users have been wanting for so long so of course being a Focusrite interface you also get the great construction quality the great tone quality you get that really guaranteed Focusrite engineering that works right off the box you don't have any headaches any problems you have the really great low latency and all the other features that's been present on the Focusrite third gen because this is an update so if you already loved and enjoy the third gen Focusrite the fourth gen is gonna be even better because of its new features. There's so much new things added to the fourth gen compared to the third gen that makes it a really good update interface. So what do you think about the Focusrite fourth gen Scarlet? So as always, leave your thoughts and opinions down in the comments. And if you're gonna be getting one, also mention it and leave it down in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching. This was Soundkitter. Don't forget while you're commenting to like and subscribe to keep the channel live and active. There's a lot coming soon. So this was Soundkitter and I'll see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.